Hi everybody, it's Carla. Hope your Saturday is going well. Uh, the weather is supposed to be turning really cold starting tomorrow down here, here in Alabama. And uh, rain moving in and all, so um, I guess fall is over, or what they called up north, Indian summer. It's done. But today is still pretty. We have a window open over there. And we have uh, my little girl here, my little Adora doll baby. And you can see her, she's wearing a little thrifted snowsuit that I got the other day for 99 cents. It's originally from Old Navy. You can hear my cat down there playing with the toy. And um, yeah, it was from Old Navy, size 0 to 3 months. And it's really cute. It looks like she's got a scarf draped over her shoulders. But it's actually attached to the snowsuit. It's got the self mittens and the little booties. And then it has a little... Uh, hood that's on it. Now the only thing that was wrong with this, it was perfect other than the little um, pom-pom at the top was kind of matted together. I don't know if it had ran through the dryer a few times and the edges just kind of clumped together and I just pulled it up and cut about an inch off all the way around. Instead of it being a ball, now it looks like a little fluffy flower so it's still very cute on her and so she's ready for the cold weather. But what I wanted to show you too, if you watched my craft video the other day, I had used some uh, Christmas gift bags from Dollar Tree and they have the, the really popular um, graphic on there of the old truck with a uh, Christmas tree on it. And so I had made two of those pictures and have them hanging in my living room. And then I went to Dollar General and I found a um, coordinating uh, pot holder and oven mitt. Now they were a dollar each. The oven mitt doesn't have the truck on it. It's got the tree um, presents, the snow, but the pot holder actually has an old truck on it with a wreath on the front, the tree in the uh, truck bed, some really pretty houses in the background, the snow all around, and the gifts in the front. So if you wanted to make one of those pictures, if you had a frame that you could repurpose and all you'd need to do is buy the gift bag and then at Dollar General buy this pot holder and oven mitt, you could have a really cute gift for a secret Santa, a teacher, um, a friend, a family member, somebody at your church. It would be really cute and it would be three, maybe four dollars spent on one present. Or if you just wanted it for yourself to have a Christmas uh, theme um, to decorate your own home with. It's just really, really cute. And then I wanted to show you one more thing. My poor hubby's over there. He got out of the hospital yesterday. He had a hip replacement, so he does not feel very good today, and he's trying to sleep. But I wanted to show you, too, at Dollar uh, General, they had um, novelty hats, and it was down the Christmas aisle. And this would fit a little toddler girl, and it looks like it's got the little long ear flaps and the front little furry piece and it's got little uh, furry ears and then it has reindeer uh, antlers coming out of it and this was in pink but they also had it in uh, uh, light blue for a boy so pink for a girl and blue for a boy so if you have a little reborn that this would fit it'd be adorable and if you have a little human toddler baby or a, a little bit bigger baby this would fit and it would be so sweet. So like I said, it's only a dollar and that's at Dollar General. So I just wanted to pass those on to you if you want to take a look. I think I got those two days ago. They'll probably still be in your store locally if you can look for them. And they were just really cute and very inexpensive. So I hope you like this little Adora doll. She's my sweet little girl. And like I said, this is zero to three months. It's just a wee bit big on her, but that's fine. Um, She's just very happy and very cozy right now. And we just wanted to show you our latest thrift find. So hope everyone's having a great weekend. And uh, stay uh, warm wherever you're at. And uh, we will talk.